Two but, minute, two yeah. minute. But let's come to let's come to one thing. You see, one of the really interesting things I find now I'm talking about life beyond us. One of the nice things, so we're done with evolution. Now we're talking about life beyond us. One of the nice <laughs> things that I find about Quranic narrative is that it says we created seven heavens and of earth a similar number. In geocentric model of earth, there is no way to fit this again. Yeah. But mm. this is this is one again minute. a very interesting. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Go on. Yeah. No, I was going to say on the first one in the Mithla Hunna that uh, seven heavens and from the earth like them as well like the heavens as well now this is interesting because it's very kind of mind-boggling when you read it you think what what is this talking about because there's only one earth there ain't seven earths so i don't know yeah but again in terms of this idea that you know seven could be many here seven yeah here mean that like just like a there are many universes in all, in many of those universes, and surely in our universe, there are other planets that have contained life. Mm. So this is very interesting. And then, you know, what I find really interesting in Quran is, for example, Surah 17, verse 17, it says, God has preferred humans who are a large number of what he has created, not who are all of what he has created. Yeah, that, so that surely is... there are things which are more higher in terms of consciousness than humans, High, capable of doing higher evil and or higher good, mm. able to reach you know divine much and that's, better. You know humans. what's interesting there as well. It specifies the children of Adam and وَلَقَدْ كَرَّمْنَا بَنِي آدَمْ عَلَى كَثِيرٍ مِمَّنْ خَلَقْنَا تَفْضِيلًا عَلَى كَثِيرٍ لَيْسَ عَلَى كُلْ you know not upon yeah, of no. everything but وَلَكِنْ عَلَى كَثِيرٍ but many which is yeah. Which is but, true, like on we predominate, but does not mean that there are not alien species which are much higher than us. I mean, one thing that I blows my mind apart is this verse, Surah 40, verse uh, 57, when it says that the creation of heavens and earth is a greater thing than the creation of men, but most men know not. This mm. blows my mind apart because, yeah. you know, in most of the world religions and even in Islamic theology, humans, humans, humans are supposed to be the center thing about the creation. But Quran just says, no, that's not true. I mean, in Surah 40 verse 29, it says we created heavens and earth. So heaven here meaning the universe and put living creatures in both of them. So there are definitely living creatures in the universe. And even though we have preference in terms of we are preferred over all life on earth, there is no way we are preferred in all life on in our universe and certainly not the multiverse. And I find it so nice that Quran says that, you know, you, you're you too small. The creation of heaven and earth is much greater than your creation. But you don't know. You think you're the center of the universe. You're not. Mm. 